Hi, I am back again, and I want to talk about the Booktubeathon. I actually wanted to give credit to the two Booktubers that came up with this. I believe, what was her name? Raylene of Padfoot and Prongs 07. I hope I got that right. I'm sorry if I didn't. And Ariel. I'm just going to call her Ariel. I don't know her whole Booktube identity name yet, so... I don't want to muss anything up. So, basically, the challenges for that are, the first one is to read 300 pages a day. I will try. I will try to do that. I have a really weird work schedule, so I'll just have to get up super early <laughs> so I can put as much time into reading as possible. Uh, the second challenge is to read a book with 500 pages. I chose Reached because it is just over 500 pages and the other challenge, which would be challenge 4, I'm sorry I'm jumping ahead, is to finish a series. So that is going to kill two birds with one stone. Cause I have, I've never been the fastest reader and I just, I want to try to maximize as much, get it, you know, the challenges done and everything. And be able to do them and not feel all hairy. Because it's not supposed to be about that. It's supposed to be fun. And uh, it's not something I want to stress about. Like I said, it's supposed to be fun. Okay. Since I skipped over the third challenge, which is to reread a book. This is a kind of a double whammy in itself. This is um, Water for Elephants. I love the movie. I love the book. I am obsessed with this. Anybody at my job can tell you, two years ago, I was obsessed with this. I played this audiobook consistently ad nauseum at work. And so we have listen to an audio and reread. So that's challenge three and six. So I'm going to knock those two out. Challenge number five is read a book that's been on your shelf forever. Now, I know for a fact this book, Almost Home by Joan Bauer, has been on my shelf for at least probably over a year or more. And it's a short read, it's not very long, but it's got a, it's got a dog in it, and I, I love animals, so. My next one, the last challenge, is to read a classic, and I am going to read A Tree Grows in Brooklyn and kind of already started it so it's by Benny Smith I like it it's 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 a little tough going here and there it's very very descriptive for the time period of the 1920s so yeah alright that is it those are my books and I and you look forward to hearing how everyone else's book to a bond challenge is going to go so all right. Have a good day.